Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil. Of course, it is time to start our Leon B scenario. Now, I have, after much deliberation, decided that I'm not going to do Claire's uh, B scenario or Leon's A scenario on this channel. Main reason is there's such little differences i mean there's 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 basically no difference at all um apart from a slight mix up of the items um whereas in the original game the b scenario was humongously different um to the a scenario in this one it really isn't you you start off in a different place and the item placement is ever so slightly different and the ending is obviously different because in the in the B scenario you do get the uh, the, the the true ending. Um, but apart from that, it's basically it really is the same game. So we are going to do Leon uh, for the B scenario because we did Claire A. I have done the walk the, the walkthrough. I have done a playthrough of Leon A, Claire B. Um, for my YouTube, uh, for my Twitch channel, and I think we finished Claire A in just over three hours. Uh, I have complete been through this game a few times, but I've mainly focused on Claire A. In fact, actually, if I go, mm -mm -mm. where's extra modes? Extra modes like this DLC has just dropped as well, and. Ugh. Like, I've played it a little bit, but to me, I didn't really like it, to be honest. I'm not going to grumble, because it's free. But I don't really like the whole idea of the fourth survivor. The fact that it's just a monster slalom, basically. And, uh, like, I might have been more interested in it if there was some story, or there was a reason, or some cool unlocks. But... There really isn't, and to be honest, like I find the gameplay of it not that fun or interesting. Uh, I've completed them all apart from the Forgotten Soldier on the training mode. Uh, I did go through that one a couple of times yesterday, and I died. Uh, I went through about four times yesterday, and I kept dying at the end. And I was just like, you know what? I, there's other games to play. I, I got other things to do. Um, it's just, I find the, the, the style very, very tedious and very frustrating for literally no reward. I mean, if we, there is another one that we can unlock in there as well, which is, um, like a, a survival with the cop in the beginning in the petrol station, which is kind of interesting, but you've just got to kill a hundred enemies and you can unlock infinite ammo, which is cool, but infinite ammo only for the extra mode. So... I don't give a shit, to be honest. Um, when they first announced this DLC, they kind of made it out like it was going to be four um, or three short stories, which sounded really interesting, but not quite. It's... Yeah, it's like a Resident Evil Dark Souls kind of thing. And like I say, it's cool, it's free. I'm not going to complain about it, but I didn't really enjoy it. So anyway... Let's get into a uh, new game, second run. We're going to go Leon. We're going to go standard. I must do hardcore at some point. Even all the cutscenes and things are all exactly the same as well. Boom, baby. Come on. Don't jump up, Stubbs. What's going on? I don't know. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? 
Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Her red kill. Man, I love this beginning. It's so epic. Claire, are you okay? Yeah, I'm all right. How about you? I'm sure she's fine. Right, you are. I'll be there. Let's do this. Okay. Now, straight from the off, I was very disappointed with the B scenario because we don't actually have to get to the police station. We just kind of turn up at the police station. There's no, like, cool going through. Claire. I hope you I'm sure she did. Uh, yeah, you just kind of get through here. And instantly start. Now, it's going to sound like I'm ragging on this game quite a bit, but I'm just pointing out my disappointments at the moment. I still utterly love this game. This game is amazing. But there, there are a few. Um, I'm just going to be real with you. I'm just going to point out the things that slightly irked me. This is still, unless something incredible comes out, this is still going to be my game of the year. And look down here. We have the underpass. Now, there's no way of getting Brad down here or anything because obviously we start here straight away. But wait, we have a chain link fence. And I hear a helicopter. Oh my. We also have zombies. We can also change our costumes. Uh, I love that Elsa Walker outfit. That is my favorite Elsa. Uh, that is my favorite outfit for Claire. It's so good. <laughs> I downloaded these earlier. I haven't tried them yet. You know what? Just for this cutscene... Let's go with it. I love the idea of these cutscenes, but I don't think I'm going to play through the entire game with them. They are very, very... I mean, look at that. Okay, I mean, come on. That is cool, right? That is so cool. Right, let's grab up this blue herb. Why not? It is so freaking cool. Oh, look, they even have... You can even see the polygons where the, the two parts of... Leon's body are coming apart. I mean, come on, man. That's freaking sweet. You can't say it isn't. That is what you call fan service. Yeah. <laughs> Leon, I'll be right it's one way to save uh, on performance, I suppose. Meeting like this. Are you alright? <laughs> Please just, 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 it just looks so yeah. weird. I'm fine. I take it you don't have the key. No, I don't. It's good to see your face though. First coffee of the day. Well, I'm hanging in there. Well, the night, mm -hmm. huh? Yeah. Find your brother? I did actually. He's Boom. Get going. Oh boy. Looks like these guys are a little bit hangry. Get yourself to see. I love the way that fence like buckles. It looks so good. Yeah, we're gonna make it. I've seen the future. I really like the energy between um, Claire and Leon in this one as well. There's way more to it in this. Oh, piss off. Almost, almost. The oh, yeah, I forgot about you. There's way more um, chemistry between them in this game. And it's actually really good as well. Now, let's change our costumes back. Because as much as I love it, it's not... Nah. Uh, da, 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 da. Should we go with Leon Noir? Noir. I like the sheriff as well. The sheriff's cool. 
Yeah, let's go with Sheriff Leon. And Claire can be Elsa, because that's my favourite costume for her. Uh, right, let's get out of it. Let's go. Right, now we're really pushing the PS4 Pro's uh, GPU to its limits. Right, let's get inside. Now, one thing that's really interesting in the uh, second run as well is we get different weapons. Our standard handgun round is now the 45 ACP, which is a much more powerful round, obviously, than a 9mm. Not exactly how I pictured breaking this in. Hand grenade. Does Leon not get it here, though? No, he does. He gets the M19. So, yeah, well, we got the Dulux. We have got the infinite combat knife, and we've got the infinite uh, Samurai's Edge from me completing the game. We are going to use the infinite combat knife. Because to me, it makes more sense. But we're not going to be using the infinite... Um, handgun because that is cheating I right, don't need you don't need you probably not going to use the Matilda at all to be honest because you don't really get a lot of 9mm but we do get the 45 ACP which is supposed to be like um, massively more powerful in practice I haven't really noticed much difference between it to be honest um, Claire gets the um, cult that was her hidden weapon in the original, which, again, pure fan service. And it's glorious as well. Uh, I don't know. No. I don't know if we get to upgrade this bad boy. It's quite cool to get a 1911, though. There's no information, really, as to whether we get to upgrade it. Oh, he holds it gangster style as well, like like a little throwback there to the original. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. We do have our unlimited blade as well. Oh, fuck. Hello. You cheeky little monkeys. Let's get you guys out of here. Right, there we go. Ooh, nope, I don't think so, love. You can jog on. Uh, we've... Oh, we're going the right way. You're down. Right, can we... Nope, she's going to get it. She's going to get it. Unfortunately, love, I kind of want my blade back. Oh, man. Come on. Can I get me knife back? I cannot get my knife back. Oh, this has gone horribly wrong, isn't it? Ah, I want my infinite knife back. I guess that's kind of... Damn it. Come on. Oh, nice. That's perfect. Well, that was incredibly embarrassing, I must be honest. Yeah, I know how to use the blade. Okay, let's get out of here. Yeah, that was awful. Yo. Um, let's use our key. And finally get back into the whole Resident Evil atmosphere. Cool. Right, that's all we use that key for as well. So we can discard that bad boy. There we go. This is not how I imagined my first Yeah, I know, Leon, buddy. I know. But this is more fun. Than you ever could have imagined, my friend. Um, you, I don't trust. No, we're good, apparently. Alright, let's kill these guys. Because we don't want these guys interfering with our day. Okay, cool. Now, we can go this way straight away. Because Claire has already been this way. Let's finish Elliot off. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. But it's the end for you now, my friend. Now, that is one main difference. The book we get is different. We get a missing page. But that's fine. 
Let's continue opening these doors. Uh, there should be bullets here. Have I missed... No, I haven't missed anything out there. Yeah, so there's no board. We can't actually... Yeah, I know how flash grenades work, game. Honestly, you don't have to keep telling me these silly things. Let's get rid of you. Damn, that dude really wants in, doesn't he? He really wants in. Look, mate, if you want in that much, just, yeah, let yourself in. Get some gunpowder. Hey, buddy. Welcome to the party, my friend. We don't need you getting up and biting our ass, to be honest. If you don't mind, you can just stay there and think about what you've done. Uh, right, so we've got a herb here, which we kind of want. How many slots have we got? Only two. All right, no matter. Now, I also think Leon's weapons are a lot more fun. Case in point, Leon's shotgun is oh so good. I'm a big, 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 big fan of the shotgun. Uh, now, if I... We've got the valve handle. It's also a herb. Now, the fuse that we need, we don't get here. So we have to go this way. Come on, little buddy. Let's go. Hopefully, we're not going to run into any monsters. Oh, look, there's half of Elliot. Ah. There's also another combat knife which we don't need. Anybody going to come through these doors? Or windows, I should say. I guess not. At least not yet. Get some more cartridges. Only two. You don't get shotgun ammo in like very high quantities. But... The shotgun is an impressively powerful beast in this game. And we are going to use it to its full effect. It's great for decapping zombies. More powder. And more, more bullets. Good. Yeah, I love the 45 in this game. I wish it was more powerful. Um... I mean, if it is, it's only very slightly. But, never mind, I guess. Ooh, magnum ammo. Yes, please. Now, I must admit, I don't think I used the magnum ammo, uh, the magnum that much at all. Reason being, um, when I originally played this, uh, B scenario, no, when I originally played Leon scenario, I personally just found out that we had so many weapons. You know, we will take that knife. Just so that clears that up. What is apparently in that fire escape? Did we miss a board? Maybe. We may have missed a board or something. Oh, we did. Okay. That's fine. Now, we are going to be going through here a little bit more often. So, let's patch you up, like so. Yeah, um, in the original uh, playthrough that I had with Leon, I had so much ammo and weapons that, honestly, I never used... There is an F8 spray in here, but I mean, I guess we can take it. No reason in not, I suppose. We had so many like weapons and stuff. Like I never used it. I don't think I may have used it like towards the end. And there's the hi one of the hiding spots. I wish once you knew where the hiding spots were, um, you could just take the item. Because it's kind of a pain to have to come all the way back here. Later on. Do we have a zombie in here? We do not. Coast is clear. 
Uh, I would like the board. But we can grab that on the way back. It's not an issue. Right, let's get this place fired up so we can get the fuck out of here. There we are. Now, one of the biggest glaring differences in this area is there's no item box. Is there it? is another first aid spray, which Somebody I will take. Here. Some more bullets. And that's quite nice. Yeah, we actually have zombies in this area. A couple of zombies, actually. Which is interesting. Now, due to the fact that we're going to be running around here with a certain Mr. X chasing our ass, let's get rid of these Zeds. We really don't want these Zeds. Hey Marvin, I know buddy, I know, I'm sorry pal, I'm sorry, but I don't need you chewing my face today, I hope you understand. Ah, uh, we've got a screamer as well, she is quite angry, there she is, hey love, sorry my dear, but you need to settle down a little bit. Let me free you from your existence of pure pain. By giving you lots of pain. But it's good pain. So I hope you understand. Right, cool. What are we on actually? We're on 21. That's fine. Um, now. Uh, what statue is this? Oh, this is the lion. Now they actually have changed the combinations uh, from the A scenario. But me being smart... I wrote them all down because I'm smart crown now that is if they're the same for Leon and Claire which I kind of assume they would be uh, about to find out yeah okay so it doesn't matter who you play as it just matters on the scenario cool uh, whilst we're here there is bullets down one of these ways. We should probably also sort out the library. We need the club key, which we don't have just yet. There's bullets here. Lovely. I want the bullets. You're doing a bang up job there, Leon. Proud of you, buddy. Um, is there any point in yeah, yeah, yeah. We need another item box, really, before we do too much more. But we'll go scout this place out. We do need the... We do need the other key. Now, again, there's no point reading the pamphlets and whatnot because they're all the same. Now, this one was the waiting room. So, it's left six. Uh, two right. And then 11. But it is an upgrade for the Matilda. And, like I said, um, there's no point in really upgrading the, the Matilda in this. Because unless you make the 9mm ammo yourself, it's kind of pointless. Which is an interesting uh, change to the game. I actually like the way that you get a totally different class of pistol. But it's odd, the way they went around uh, about it, to say the least. Uh, more bullets in here, which is nice. We'll have them. Uh, there's also a herb that we can't take. It's actually a massive pain in the ass as well that the main... Oh, yeah. I actually forgot about this. 
In the second scenario, this is a little bit more faithful to the original, isn't it? Hey, buddy. We're not going to piss the liquor off. Because liquors are goits. They are nightmare fuel in this game. They really are. Now, luckily, as far as I remember with Leon... Really? Really? You can look, Milados, but you can't touch. You can look, but you can't touch at this majestic creature known as Leon. Who gives no shits about you. Record of events. Yep, we've already read that. That's the map. Which is very nice. Now we can go up there, but because we're on the A scenario, or the B scenario, we can just do that. So, you know. Um, now we've used that up. We can get rid of you. Yep, discard. Take the detonator. And there's another board there. We'll have the board. Sure. Anything else? Another flash grenade. We'll have him in a minute. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of you. Really don't want these zombies in this corridor. Keep this area as clean from Zeds as humanly possible. Are you dead, buddy? Maybe you're dead. You should be dead. Alright, let's get rid of him as well. Don't want... Uh, no, 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 no. You're not getting up. You're not getting up. Look, you can whinge about your, your sad twist of fate all you like. Okay? But I don't really care about your plight. Are you still going? No stopping you, is there, mate? Or so you think. I have an actual blade that was made by humans Shit. that actually lasts more than a couple of swipes. Come on, you. Get down. Actually, I kind of take it back. The 45 is definitely killing these guys quicker. Uh-oh. He has a friend. Hello, love. Come on. Come on. Come this way. Don't trip over the corpse of your friend. Who may or may not actually be your friend. We will never know. But yeah, the knife really does help against the zombies. Really does. Oh, God. Hello. Who's making all that noise now? Oh, hello. Alright there, chief. Son of a bitch. Come to daddy. Daddy's got something for you. Oh, God. Ooh, nice try. Nice try. Mate, your arm's just fallen off. And your legs are made of sterner stuff. They're definitely stronger than the average zombie. I think he's also dead. Must have used all of his HP up on his legs. No matter. Uh, can't have you, but we can have you. Ah, let's get in here. Let's free up some of our space. Don't need that. Don't need that. We'll hold on to that for now. We're going to use that in a second. We don't need that. Uh, we don't need the spare knife. Okay. Let's turn the light on. Now, what do we have? We've got some more gunpowder. We've got some more bullets. Cool. Not bad. Not bad at all. There should be a red herb there. I think we can do there, yep. Right, let's drop that down. Alright, let's go looting. Oh, what was that? Go on. Go on, we'll have him. We'll have him. Stick him. Stick him in. 
Uh, we'll take that as well. It's just explaining on how we use health items, which if you've played Resident Evil once in your life, you'll already know how health items work. Uh, we can go into the west office, I suppose. Oh, the chief! Yeah, thought that was coming. You are quite the tough customer. Give me that. Yeah, he's dead. Alright, more gunpowder. Another memo. Yeah, we know how to make gunpowder. This locker usually literally contains nothing. So how many... Yeah, it contains two bullets. Not really sure what the point is, but I suppose we'll have them. Right, let's see if we can slice this guy's legs off. Come on, buddy. Come on, give it up, give it up. There we go. Right, now this one. This one is actually one that we want. This is nine. 15. Seven. This one actually has something worthwhile. Oh, yes. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Cool. And I think you can hear my husky uh, whining. He's fine. Yep. So this is Ned. And the other one, it was Ned and MRG. Um, oh. Again, this is another like totally useless upgrade because this is an upgrade for the Matilda. It's not useless because it's a really freaking cool upgrade, but it's useless because we're not going to use it. We'll have that too. Um, the weapon storage or the safety deposit room we will come back to later. Let's go clear this room out. Whilst we remember, there's another herb here. We'll have it. Okay, cool. Let's head upstairs. What are we on? Uh, we're on 30 minutes. That's cool. So let's go end it right here. Um, drop you, 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 you. There we go. Actually, no. We're just going to go up here. And we'll end the video up here because... There is something up here. I kind of want to sort out sooner rather than later. Let's grab the bullets. Oh, I forgot about you. Yeah, there is Zeds up here on the second run. No, come on. There we go. That was a pain. I totally forgot about you, mister. Yeah, I've only played the B scenario once, and that was with Claire. So, bear that in mind. I don't want to say it's a blind run, because it absolutely is not. But, you get the idea. Uh, is this one... DCM. I remember that one. And that one has... Ooh, five magnum bullets. Nice. And that will give us that, which is also very spiffy. Hmm. Okay, so that gives us... A lot of options. But before we do that, yeah, let's go in here. Oh, we can actually go set up for Mr. X now. Thinking about it. Hmm. Okay. Got a few options and things that we can do. Uh, what do I want to do first? Let's go through here. Yeah, a uh, little bit fuzzy on the best route through the B scenario. Let's use this. 
So we can switch that off. This one is... Uh, is this the cap? Yeah, cap. Three cartridges, which isn't too bad. More cartridges, which is nice. Nothing. Oh! Portable safe instructions. Yeah, nice. Okay. We could actually go get the scepter now before we go through there. But the portable safe wasn't there, which is interesting. I actually thought the portable safe was there. No, I guess not. Right, okay, I'm going to go back to the item box. Make some room. And then we'll call it a video there, guys. Once we start getting all the keys, we'll be in a better position. Uh, drop you. Drop you, drop you for now. Drop you. Okay, cool. Already starting to pick up uh, quite a nice amount of stuff. I'm not going to use the high-grade gunpowder to make shells yet. I'm going to see if we run into a big um, gunpowder before we start mixing that stuff up. So, anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'm going to leave it here. As always, till next time.